I don't know if I look puffy, but... I don't think it's fair for me to say. <laughs> it feels that. High quality goose down park. Taking all the down with me. All right, we're right there. This is the same stuff we've been using to insulate ourselves since the beginning of time. And you're telling me there's nothing better than animal byproducts like goose down to keep you warm? Like, come on, it's the 21st century. It looks like roughly uh, at its greatest width, 15 millimeters of insulation. This is Oros's Orion Parka. This is before it's called the warmest jacket in the world. So that's it? That's it. That's uh, inside liner all the way to exterior fabric of the Orion Parka. How thick is that? It's a little over three millimeters. It's nuts, yes. Like even just like that, like you can see how thin it is. You can see that it's just, I mean, that's it. So this jacket's been taken to the negative 40 degree Fahrenheit uh, temperatures of Antarctica. Uh, and when I mean this jacket, this, this is all that there was. Negative 40 degree Fahrenheit, right here. Three millimeters between all the insulation and all the fabrics. Whatever, in our little room, it's crazy, it's almost here though. You know, like putting something like solar core into a jacket, compared to like these things that were known, like down and synthetic fills, like, it wasn't done before. So there was this big learning curve. But then I look at this and I think like, yeah. That's the difference. Roughly the same amount of insulation, significantly less bulk with the solar core insulation. 